Wow, look at the view, guys. Whoa. Great. It would be even better if I could catch a fish using rods or a spear gun. Because I came here for four days or more, but I got food just for like I don't know, one day or two. All right, pl please don't fall. All right. First, I'm gonna use some plastics. Let's go. All right, first cast, small soft bait. Let's go. I got some headwind. Cannot cast far. Yeah, the conditions are far from ideal. Headwind, some waves, and I cannot go further. All right, came back to the spot. First cast, let's try. I got two options. Option number one. I'm eating rice with peanuts or I'm catching the fish right now.
the moment of truth what I'm gonna eat for lunch I'm so excited actually because it is boom rice hey that's me um, I want to clear one thing guys you're not gonna see me often speaking to the camera so if you prefer that type of content you're not gonna find it here often because uh, I prefer to show what surrounds me my channel always gonna be about adventure about some wild wild adventures like now I brought here this huge can of water it's like 15 liters left I don't know something like that and I'm gonna show you just how I spend my days fishing, camping, spear fishing, diving enjoying the nature sometimes just chilling yeah and uh, later on and I'm gonna learn spear fishing. I'm gonna do the real su survival challenges. As for now, it's just my third time, or or even no, second time when I'm I'm using the spear gun. Later, when I'm gonna move to another island, the fishing and diving conditions gonna be much better. This is just a random spot. Where I'm waiting for a ship that's gonna go there. You cannot see it now. Or maybe you can a little bit. It's like 10 hours, I don't know, something like that. And the condition's gonna be much better. This place is absolutely wild and it's it's not uh, like I would rate it 5 out of 10 by Indonesian standards. So and later gonna be 9 or 10 out of 10. So you're gonna see just stay tuned. Soon I'm gonna show you something special and they're not gonna be my face indeed that's gonna be our beautiful planet I'm holding my worst enemy one of the hundreds you know what I'm not joking now there are crocodiles nearby and I saw uh, snakes track fresh fresh track but you know you don't encounter those often or nearly never but these things they bite hard somehow does not focus but um, this one I captured because I already hit it really really hard really really hard and then still it is still very alive because it takes four hard hits to kill it Ah, it flew away Okay, it's the same one Look, now the second hit If I'm gonna hit There we go Oh, it's alive Oh Oh It's injured but it's still It's crazy I've changed the spot, it's much better here Nice shade and the uh, ocean is there I wanted to say one interesting fact that those mountains in the distance is already another country it's uh, Timor Leste or East Timor and actually it's on both sides there is East Timor here is Indonesia and there is East Timor again so actually that spot there is called Oyakuse Exclave it's literally trapped in between Indonesia like uh, Kaliningrad in the uh, Baltics
so yesterday I had to change the campsite again so I moved two times yesterday because uh, my second worst enemy used to attack me and that millions of ants they just crawling into my hammock via ropes and it was I don't know, thousands of ants in my hammock, so I came here. Boom. Now we are on day off, or I don't know. At night time we got some serious ADHD, some serious activity. Now we are gone. When you are within the nature, you have to accept whatever it offers you. Usually it offers nice things, but sometimes just too much horse flies or ants or scorpions. Yeah, scorpions are an issue as well. Wow, what's a coincidence, but actually it's not. I've just told about scorpions, that scorpions are an issue as well. And look at this. I just wanted to put my small backpack with fishing gear to move to the beach to go fishing. Look at this. Look, look, look at this house. Oh my God. Boom. Fresh scorpion. And I almost put this strap on. It's so small that you even cannot see the tail. And the smaller it is, the more poisonous it is. And this is as small as possible. Look at it. Do you think it's gone? Yes. Do you think I ki already killed it? Now, they are always, always hiding somewhere. Boom. It's under now. It moved away. And that's how people are getting into problems. So I did not catch anything. Now resting. All right, I'm back, but the water is choppy, and there's a this annoying wave and the headwind. Yeah, nothing. Going back. It was a good place here, but uh, yeah, it's no more shade. I've told you about the snakes. Here it is. Snake tracks. That plane line, not, not that one. This is crab. That one is crab. This one is snake. Yeah, I'm coming here. I think snakes are better than scorpions because it's easier to spot them. Scorpions are scary because they're so small. Maybe this spot here. It's not the same, I mean it's different. Oh my god, huge snake, look at it. Look at the tracks. Wow. 
so many snakes. I'm walking with my precious water. It's like 500 meters. Not too heavy anymore because I use half of it was 20 liters now like nine left. I could easily stay two more nights but the thing is that I got just two portions of food. Just two portions. And that's it. I have to catch something or just get out of here to the nearest village and get food. Ini dapur untuk apa? Kayu. Pakar, kebun. Untuk pakar pertanian. Untuk dapur? Bukan, bukan, bukan. Apa? Pakar. Awal tembok, tembok kebun, pakar kebun. Ah, batas ini. Ah. Aduh, ya kita kena. Anda lihat ular? Ular. Oh, saya lihat seperti ini. Iu, iu, iu. Di sini biasa, warna dua, dua warna. Warna yang hitam putih. Ah, dari laut ini. Oh, ini ada, ada, ada. Biasa di sini. Ah, ini ada di laut hitam putih, hitam putih. Ya, ini. Kadang-kadang ada di lubang batu ini. Hah? Kadang-kadang ada di lubang batu ini. Ada. Ini, ini angker. Hah. Ya sudah. Okay, saya ambil ini cuci spray untuk dan datang sana. 